Hey folks, this is Mike Hatch, Men's Ministry Director at Orchard Hill Church, and I want to take a moment and challenge men out there, specifically men if you are a Christian man, if you consider yourself a man of God uh, in a business industry or wherever you find yourself, in whatever industry you find yourself, especially if you're in a position of influence, I want to challenge you today. I just finished the Life Code Conference through the Thrival Festival here at Phipps Conservatory in Pittsburgh. And it was absolutely fascinating, enlightening, learned a ton. There were people from every industry represented discussing uh, the impact that the fourth industrial revolution will have on every single one of our lives uh, in every single one of our industries. Uh, and this is going to cause a great disruption. Uh, that's kind of a buzzword uh, in technology right now, of course, and it was here too. Uh, the disruptive nature of the fourth industrial revolution. Uh, and disruption connotes the idea that Really, we call into question the things we used to be sure of. And here, the theme of this conference was what makes us human. And of course, that kind of mirrors the, uh, the sentiment that Kevin Kelly uh, said in his book, The Inevitable, where he said that the technological advantage, advances are happening at such, at such a mock speed right now and are so profound that it's going to call into, into question for all of us our very humanity. What makes us human? And so they discussed that today. And I didn't really hear too many really great, clear answers or clear definitions of actually what makes us human. There were helpful insights in terms of some of the attributes of what makes us human. But when you think about it from a Christian biblical worldview, what makes us human can't be separated actually from God. Because if we are created by God to be uh, image bearers or to reflect the image of God, and so who we are as human the attributes of who we are are actually a reflection of who God is. And so what's interesting is, as this disruption happens in every industry, men, uh, we're going to find ourselves uh, in a place, I think, of a unique opportunity. Whereas people are going to question who they are and what makes them human, um, I think the Bible offers the most compelling uh, answer to that. And that is, we were made in the image of God. And who we are is defined by how God created us and who he created us to be. And so men, as, as, as we navigate through this challenge, these challenging waters, these challenging times of technology, um, you men who are in places of authority or influence, who are Christian men of God, out there in all sorts of different industries, man, you need to be on your toes. Uh, because as people are disrupted in all sorts of different ways, um, you need to value them as, uh, as people who are made in God's image and have uh, eternal intrinsic value. And we need to be ready to answer them with the hope of the gospel, which, uh, which ultimately answers this question of who we are as human. So uh, men, that's your challenge, and uh, I hope you accept.